As it has been during the two previous visits of his Asia tour, a lot of attention is on how the American leader is being welcomed by his host. According to our Kim Mogen, Beijing takes the cake in that category. In fact, some dub the gestures as an imperial treatment, which includes a few unprecedented honors. Take a look. Since U.S. President Donald Trump landed in China, Beijing has been rolling out the red carpet, giving the American leader the royal treatment. As he and the First Lady arrived in Beijing on Wednesday, they were greeted by a small army of children waving American and Chinese flags as part of an elaborate welcoming ceremony. They were then west to the Forbidden City, where President Xi Jinping and his wife Peng Yuan gave the Trumps a personal tour of China's rich and ancient history. The U.S. President and First Lady were also given the honor of dining in the former seat of emperors, Trump becoming the first foreign leader to have an official dinner in the historic venue since founding of the People's Republic in 1949. China's ambassador to the U.S., Chui Tian Kai, earlier stressed the importance and significance of President Trump's visit, claiming that it would be a state visit plus. During the second day of the trip, President Xi welcomed Trump by holding a grand 15-minute welcoming ceremony in Tiananmen Square, shutting down the usually busy traffic around the square. Another piece of special treatment President Trump enjoyed in China was that he was able to tweet during his trip. Though China officially has blocked mainland access to Twitter and other global social networking services since 2009, President Trump didn't seem to have any difficulty with the ban as he posted several tweets thanking the Chinese leader for his hospitality. Ahead of Trump's arrival, China's vice foreign minister Zhang Zhuguang said that the U.S. president will be able to tweet as much as he wants, adding that China takes everything into account regarding visits from foreign heads of state. Kim Mo-kyun, Arirang News.